So you guys asked for my everyday makeup look, so here it is. I usually start with primer. My favorite one, like I always, always, always start with MAC. The softening lotion. Everywhere I go, any country I visit, I have to have this. I swear by this product. Next is Fast Response Eye Cream. Or you feel like you need it, just put it there. Now next one is I have the Prep and Prime by MAC. I have it in the shade of Radiant Pink. You know, less is more. If you put on too much product, it becomes really thick and cakey and we don't want that. Next is one of my favorites really. It's NARS Multi Protect Primer. It's the one with the SPF. I've been using this since I started training for Miss Philippines in 2012. It's time to do some makeup because we did the primers already. Now this is for my skin type, NW25. It could be different with you because each one of us, we all have different skin types, skin colors. This one is an NC35. So now we do foundation. For my skin type, right, again, it might be different for you. I use an NC35 and then an NC40. So this is the lighter one, the NC35. Now, we move on to the NC42 because I'm quite tan now. It's summer. NC42 all over. This is my favorite brush. I'm sure you guys have seen this. If you're a makeup addict like me, I don't really, you know, try to blend it. I just dab. That's the base done. Now we have to seal it with some loose powder. Translucent from Laura Mercier. It's one of the finest loose powders in the world, I must say. There's a technique we call baking. I blame my European jeans for this. Now I let, just let it sit while I do the rest of my face because it has to bake, right? We're gonna do eyebrows first. I have three shades. Spike, Lingering, Fling. The Retractable Eyebrow Pencils from MAC. Now, why do we need three shades? Because it doesn't look good when you just use one shade for your eyebrows because you want to do a 3D effect with it. The darkest shade, which is the spiked one, I use it at the ends of my eyebrows. And then just a little bit here to trace it. The next shade, which is lingering. Now time to switch to the lightest shade, which is fling. We want natural looking eyebrows, so blending is the key to do it. By this time, for sure, this one should be ready. Just brush, blend it out. Now, we switch to the eyes. Now, I usually start with uh, the base. For this palette in particular, I start with guava and primrose. I just mix the two colors. Now we do contour, like, Round the eyes. Since we're doing everyday makeup, we'll keep it natural. So I get a little bit of the darker shades, maybe round truffle and a little bit of bamboo, but I really prefer the darker ones when I do under my eyes. Not really a big fan of putting a lot of eyeliner on top, but I do love a little bit of a tight line or a waterline. Some of you might find this a little bit difficult to do, but if you can, do it. If you can't, don't, don't worry about it. I don't think a lot of people will be comfortable in seeing this. They'll be like, oh, that's painful. It's not. Pain is temporary. Trophies are forever. Now, I like to do nude eyeliner at the bottom. Now 
Now guys, these are my real lashes. So, you know, I'm blessed enough to have lashes like this. <laughs> MAC, Hot and Naughty 2 Black Lash. There's two ways to use this. If you want more product, use this end of the brush. If not, use this. This is my favorite, actually. <laughs> Contouring! Medium dark mineralized finish. Basically, you get the brush like this, go like that, try to look for where your cheekbones are. MAC Harmony. Maybe two dabs, and then you just take the excess out. Now it's time for blush. NARS Dolce Vita. It's used and abused. So, blush brush. For an everyday look that's perfect for summer, kinda sexy by MAC. You don't have to be too, you know, technical with it. Just put it on. A look wouldn't be complete without a little bit of shine. So we have to put in a little bit of gloss and highlight. This is a fairly new one from Ariana Grande. It's a lip glass from the Viva Glam collection. Olivia has them too. Olivia Jordan. Becca, Shimmering Skin Perfection, and the shade that I use is Opal. Less is more, guys. Less is more. Now, guys, I hope you guys like this makeup tutorial. This is everyday makeup. Again, there are no rules in makeup. You just have to find the products that are right for you. You don't have to exactly follow what I do. But then it's really just trial and error, experiment, have fun at home. Let me know what you think and I hope you guys learned a little bit from it.